This is the first creepypasta I'm going to be recording with my new Samsung Galaxy phone. Tell me if you think the audio quality sounds better in the comments below. Once again, this creepypasta, or if you'd like to think of it as a quickie pasta, is 100% fake. Or so you thought. Just kidding. For real though, this story never happened. The story may seem a bit cliche, but you get my point. Without further ado, let's begin this quickie pasta about a cursed bag of Doritos. March 31st, 2018, 6.50am. I was waking up. My mother was not telling me to get ready for school. I just remembered, it's the weekend. I can party for two days straight. I started playing the best game in the world, WWE 2K18, on my Xbox One S for a couple hours. Of course, I always play it as none other than Ethan Chaos, my favorite call from Community Creations. He was big and muscular and could defeat anyone. Of course he got beaten a couple times, silly. When it comes to his win streak, he's no Goldberg or Undertaker, but he was an awesome World Heavyweight Champion. 9am. My dad woke up. I asked him how he was doing. I'm good, buddy. How are you? I replied as usual with, doing well. Anyways, I left him alone to watch TV for an hour or two. 10.30 a.m. My dad told me he was going shopping, and he asked me if I wanted to get anything. Of course, I replied. Could you please get me a bag of Doritos? My dad would reply back, I'll see what I can do. I thanked him as he left to go to a local top supermarket in the area. 11.30 a.m. My dad came back an hour later. To my surprise, he brought home to me a legitimate bag of nacho cheese Doritos. I thanked him and got a bowl of these wonderful tortilla chips. And to no one's surprise, they were absolutely delicious. No eventful things happened for the rest of the day, so we will skip to 3 a.m. Yep, I stayed up that late that night, playing on my Xbox One S as usual. For some reason, I could hear faint voices whispering in the dining room slash kitchen area. But to my surprise, when I checked, there was no one there. All I could see was dinner stuff, cereal, and <laughs> Sorry, guys. Anyway. All I could see was <laughs> dinner stuff, cereal, and the bag of Doritos my dad had bought me. I shrugged it off as a figment of my imagination and went to get a bowl of Doritos. Was I going insane? Nah. April Fool's Day, 4 a.m. I was getting ready for bed. I could hear those faint voices. <laughs> those faint voices again. I remember bringing my bag of Doritos to the food pantry on the top shelf. When I went to see if someone was there again, I noticed something hmm, peculiar. My bag of Doritos weren't, <laughs> weren't sitting on the top shelf. They'd mysteriously moved to the kitchen counter for some strange reason. <laughs> I thought to myself, it had been a coincidence. I got yet another bowl of Doritos. They tasted different. They were much crispier than before. They tasted like chili for some reason. And they were super spicy. I almost threw up in my mouth, man. I saw the bag of chips was no longer red. It was purple. I hate spicy sweet chili Doritos or whatever you call them. I looked for the red bag of Doritos, but to my surprise, it was gone. I screamed at the top of my lungs. My bag of chips was cursed. I didn't care if it was cold outside. I got my winter hoodie on, hoodie on and buried this cursed bag of chips. I went back to bed to try and get this bag of chips off my mind. 11 a.m. I woke up and forgot about this bag of chips. I hope this all was a nightmare. When I went <laughs> to the kitchen to... <laughs> Sorry, guys. I'm just laughing at how weird my WWE2K18 creepypasta was. Anyway, when I went to the kitchen <laughs> to make myself a plate of steak fries, not legitimate meat fries, they were just basically extra thick french fries, I noticed something odd. That specific bag of chips was spawned back under the kitchen counter. It spoke some peculiar words to me. If you don't eat me, every food you eat will taste unpleasant forever! 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 I was legitimately scared at this point. 
I replied, um, okay then. I faced my fears, got the bowl of chips ready, took a bite, and to my surprise, I ended up eating the rest of the bowl of chips. 12.30 p.m. I was going to throw up. I did throw up. I felt like I was going to throw up. I did throw up a few minutes later. When I did, as you would guess, everything mysteriously went back to normal. The purple bag of Doritos was gone, and in its place was the red bag of nacho cheese Doritos my dad bought me the day before. I thanked myself for facing my fears and uncursing myself. I got a bowl of nacho cheese Doritos to celebrate and ate them with no problem. It was finally over. Life had been back to normal, and I could eat chips with no problem ever since. Until one day. Alright guys, that's going to do it for this video. If you liked it and want to see more original creepypasta content, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. This is American Idiot Fan 2018 production signing off. Peace.